hair company. She started out as a vendor several years ago, and now she's our director of the fashion show. So <laughs> her business has grown. You know, I, it's just really great to see, you know, someone come in and be right here. And then, you know, <laughs> they moved on, you know, and not moved on away from the she event, but <laughs> moved on to do greater things, you know, within the she event. So we have that. We have our entrepreneurs who are part of the she event, who own and operate their own business. We have 10 of those who will be there. We have our um, Black Bistro and different food vendors who will be part of the she event who have awesome cuisine. Like we have no bad food vendors at all. Seriously. <laughs> Real funky. We have so many vendors who make their own body care products that we should not even be going to Bath and Body Works right now, seriously. So, I mean, it's an awesome event. So, um, also I wanted to mention that if there are individuals out there who need like credit repair, we're offering free credit repair classes during this event. Um, we're gonna do um, ballroom dance lessons there. One girl that comes from Atlanta, she'll be in a room and she'll kind of create a spa out of that room if you wanna have a spa day during the event and much, much more. And we would love to be a vendor. So I'm gonna now if we could. <laughs> Yeah. We would love, love, love. I love how you support your vendors. I love how you build community. I love why it's important to you. Uh, I love that you get excited about your vendors growing and growing their businesses. I love to hear that kids are starting to think in this way uh, and to really set themselves up for success. And that is, uh, again, you talked about it eight years ago and today you're providing all of these services that are all benefiting our community. So just thank you for that, actually. Just thank you so much for your work. Thank you for your work. <laughs> <laughs> any um, any questions or any anything that you wanted to throw my way? I love the idea, like the Halo app and the backing and um, also, you know, the loan amounts that will be available to our vendors. We need that, you know. Hey, if a vendor can take $500 and buy business cards and just things of that sort or a few supplies just to get started it could really boost their business so um to have those resources available that's going to be a huge plus i have a vendor who's been waiting to start their business like five years because they're like hey i'm just waiting until i get this and this and a table runner and i say you don't wait to start just go ahead and start you know even if it's with a few items you know, and just, a, I don't care if it's a plastic tablecloth, just get out there and get started. Get that, you know, business going and then you can get all those other things, you know, as your business grows. But as long as you got human capital and you can have a company like Halo to team with, you know, to get just a little startup capital, you'll be all right. I think seeing that, it's a deep breath. It's understanding that everybody's needed a couple hundred bucks. Like you said, it could be business cards. Mm -hmm. You're speaking my language. Yeah, and, you know, and I and I do understand business owners, you know, who are perfectionists, you know, and because presentation is everything, you can make things look nice and not, you know, have cost you a lot of money. You know, just be creative, you know, get out there on Pinterest and things like that, you know, to get ideas. But at the same time, you don't want to go overboard with overhead. A yeah. hundred dollars was valuable to me, you know with my business and everything. I would love to see some of our vendors, you know, who need resources to take out those resources and grow their business and become backers. Mm -hmm. I would like for them to become, you know, start out as requesters and become backers. I really love that.